summoned. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to summon. Summoning monsters is about the level of a monster. Levels are the stars that you find below the monster's name on a Yu-Gi-Oh card. In Yu-Gi-Oh, summons are conducted because of the level of a monster. Level means the amount of stars on a monster. More stars on a monster means a stronger monster. And firstly, the opposite is true. Less stars, the weaker the monster is. This rule doesn't apply to effect monsters, but for now, we are covering summoning monsters only. So do not pay attention to this fact. Now, normal summon. Normal summons in yu gi are done with monsters with stars that range from 1 up to 4 stars. So you can summon a monster in Yu-Gi-Oh that has 1 to 4 stars on it. While it can be rare, you may find some monsters between that have 1 or 4 stars with the summon condition. If they are effect monsters, prepare to read them carefully. If they have no summon condition, summon them normally. Advanced summon. Slash tribute summon. This form of summoning is done when a Yu-Gi-Oh monster has 5 to 6 stars. Unless the monster is an effect monster, then you must read the summoning effect condition on that monster if it has it. If not, you proceed as follows. So, advanced summoning is conducted by placing your monster in the graveyard and summoning a monster in your hand. The general rule of thumb is a monster with 5 or 6 stars on it needs one sacrifice. That means placing one monster from the field grave to summon the monster from your hand. More stars. When a monster has 7 or 8 stars, you need 2 sacrifices to summon that monster. Same rules applies like before if it is an effect monster with a summoning condition. Otherwise, proceed as normal. Sacrifice 2 monsters and summon the monster from your hand. More stars. Continue. When a monster has 9 or 10 stars, you need 3 sacrifices to summon the monster. Like before, if it's an effect monster, check if it has a summon condition. Otherwise, proceed as normal. Another thing to take note is that monsters with 11 or 12 stars are usually extra deck monsters. And even if you do get one, it's always an effect monster with summon condition. You are now one step closer to becoming a Yu-Gi-Oh! Master. My fate is in your hands. Like and subscribe. Hate and subscribe. You could decide to not subscribe at all. The choice is yours. Goodbye.